Ramsey and an unknown by the name of Billy Ray Bates climb right back into the thick of action. Bates came off Ramsey's bench to toss in 29 points. And here he is, keying the fast break and going to the open man, Calvin Nat. And the Blazers are only back by... By the way, don't you know who Dennis Johnson is? Yes, I know the guy. I heard of him. Don't you know how good he is defensively? You're not supposed to be getting off a 29 on him. Well, uh, you know, I just come out here, you know, and take my open shots and, you know, look for the good shot and look the pass off. And, you know, I just got those 29 points by playing team ball and, you know, I was wide open. Billy Ray, you're going so good in Portland. Look at this. The ministers now are making their sermons about you on Sunday. Rock of ages, Billy Ray. Shoot a jump shot, fade away. Get a slammer, that away. Fire home, a three-point play. Rock of ages, Billy Ray. We all hope you're here to stay. Are you indeed here to stay? Yes, uh, I hope so. I'm going to give it all I got, you know, show the people what I can do. And, you know, I like the system, and I hope I'm here to stay. So the delightful young man who was in the Continental Basketball Association with the Maine Lumberjacks. Now, Dennis Johnson, would he like to play Bates one-on-one -on -one tonight? That's the question that my man Bill Russell put to DJ a short time ago. <laughs> would you like to guard him? Um, I'm sure I'm going to have my turn in tonight. I like to guard anybody, though. Uh is they come on the floor and if he's my way then I'll pick him up. If not, uh, someone else will. Um, I like the challenge. I love the challenge, matter of fact. So uh, I'll be out there playing. I'm uh, giving my 100 percent just I think he will. All right, well, one last question I want to ask you now. In the last game he got 26 points. Uh, were you guarding or was that a team effort? <laughs> team effort? <laughs> no, well. <laughs> <laughs> a team effort indeed. It's been part of Easter Sunday with us. Well, I imagine the good basketball fans in Seattle will be ready. We'll have a crowd. And there's the man who launched the shot the top. DJ hits Williams. And a great block Bates. And it goes over to the Blazers. Roaring and he just rose in the air and hit it. And now there's a foul against Gusset. Comes around a Brewer screen. Goes to the jump shot. Now, uh, Billy Ray Brakes was not a physical factor in the first half. 10-6, Sonics over the Blazers. Bates on the penetration through the foul. Chance for a three-pointer. Billy made a fine move to his left that time. Well, now, he's a fine offensive player. I think that if he had any weaknesses, it would be defensively because he's a good offensive player. He's strong and he's not afraid of anybody or anything. That's obvious by the way he plays. He's a big Goes back to DJ, a man in the passing lane. Bates back quickly now to the attack. And the third has to find Brewer because he's double teamed as the Sonics now become very conscious of Calvin now on the rebound. Eyes the floor and Bates with a quick defensive hand. Off now to Shelton. Shelton missing and Bates is in the middle. Bates pressures the hoop for the Blazers. A beautiful turn of Washington. The last four or five times down, they have not gotten a good shot. Bates with a runner, got the roll. Sigma off with the shot. Shelton with a hand control now by Bates and the Blazers. And Bates streaks down the middle. Through the foul, coming right in between two sides. Breaking away, simply splitting the seams. Gus on one side, Freddie over there on the other. Drawing the foul, and that is three on Williams. And here is Billy Ray Bates, who a few months ago was playing with the main lumber truck. And tonight he said to me, no more road trips to Anchorage. <laughs> and I believe he has seen his last road trip in the Continental League. He is here to stay. You're going to set the pick on us, all right? So you're going to play weak side away, all right? Permit, you know, now we're going to go on. All right? Uh, let's run it to this side of the floor. Calvin, you'll take it at half court here. And uh, Jim Brewer, you take it out of bounds, all right? Now, Calvin, start from here and come out. Pass in, Billy, you're going to free up to receive. Boot, Ron Brewer, 
weak side away. Kermit high. Now, when Billy, you hit Calvin and get it back. Calvin, you have this or this. So you have either of those options, Calvin. Now he, he's out of there. But Jimmy is up high. Jimmy, after you pass in, take your man away and screen down and boot coming back. Jimmy is thrown direct into Billy. You're coming ball side over there. Billy to Calvin and get it back. Calvin, look to get yourself open. Either jamming in, you receive it up top, take it to the hole. You get it down here, get it. If not, you got a two man play. Down to try to get a steal. Paul Silas is matched against Nat. Nat comes over here now to the strong side and gets the pass, but he's far away from the basket. He'll send it back now to Bates. Eight seconds, one on one. Bates has fired it with five seconds to go. Timeout, Seattle. Looking, Billy Ray Bates on a breakdown. Goes to the left baseline. Hits the field goal. 14 points for Bates and we're tied in Portland. Does he notice the playoff game? <laughs> I love it. Something was on him that time. A break for the Sonics. Bates penetrates again. Offensive foul. Offensive foul. Lambs I think that was a bad call, Brent. He was open when he took off. Maybe we're going to get a chance to take another look at it and see if he's moving. Shelton's still moving. Yes, he had the opening when he took it. Now Gamble and Kermit accepts it. Now he's open. It's three on one face. Get a three point inside where he can try to make the basket with the free throw rather than chewing the three pointer. Bates comes the length of the floor. And there's the man who launched the shot that takes.